Hey, good morning, uh, Tony Talking Car Biz. Say, here's the deal. Have you ever met a customer who says to you, uh, I'm six foot plus and I got long legs, so I need a car I'm gonna fit in. That's their first concern. And then you walk them up to this little car, this Subaru, and the first thing they're thinking is, this car's gonna be too small. They open the door to get in, and sure enough, all their fears are realized. They can't get in. Uh, so they reach down here and they try to find the seat, move the seat back. Then they go ahead and move the steering wheel up and they finally get in the car. And yeah, now maybe their impression is, well, I guess it fits. But what if their impression from the word go was it fits? Wow, I'm surprised how big this car is. Well, how do you make that happen? Well, how about every time a salesperson or a lot of tenant parks a car, instead of leaving the steering wheel all the way out and pulling the seat all the way up, what if you required your, all your salespeople, new and used, to make sure when they get out of a car, they put that seat all the way back and take that steering wheel and tilt it all the way up so that when a customer goes to get in that car, it's no problem. It's like, boom, no problem. This works for big people and small people because if I'm a short guy like I am and I go to get in the car, the first thing I'm thinking is, wow, this thing's really far back. I gotta move the seat up. I gotta move the steering wheel. And even as a short guy, I start to think this car's pretty big. And as a tall guy, I'm thinking, wow, this car is really roomy. I'm surprised. And now they're focused on the car, not the fact that the car is too small. Here's a hot tip for all you used car managers. Require your salespeople to put the seat back and the steering wheel up. Require your lot of tenants to do the same. And all of a sudden, you've got a lot full of big cars with lots of room inside them. Thanks for watching.